Hey everybody, this is Scott. Uh, this is the uh, trade of the week idea. So uh, let's take a look at it here. There's a disclaimer. I'm not going to read it, but it's there in front of there so you can check it out. All right, so this is not a trade signal. We have discussed this at length in our live room, and this video is just a short recap of an idea for a big opportunity that may transpire in the near future. All trade ideas are for educational purposes only, all right? So let me go take a look in the, in the, in the charts here, and uh, this one is gonna be found on the pound Aussie right here. And uh, you know, it's an afternoon, so not much is happening here. We should have, you know, a little oscillating uh, move up, up and down here. Uh, but um, we, we're looking for this to make the turn to the downside and continue on down. Now, the pound um, Aussie has a big ATR. ATR is 190 pips, so it's a monster down here. That target is down here at 1.9041, right? So you can see here that we do have uh, uh, the MACD is uh, pointing the way, telling us we're going down. We had a T3 break right there. We had a zero line break right there. And so we're looking for this opportunity, all right? So here. here and here, all right? So there's lots and lots and lots of space here with 190 pips, as you can see, all right? So in our charts, of course, uh, you would add a position on the break of every T30. Um, you know, if you're not using our charts, obviously you don't have that uh, opportunity there to know when and when, where to put them in. We already have entry orders on the first half of this for this first move to the downside. All right, now, the, the, of course, the big part of this is this. Uh, we're in a range right here, and you can see there's a bottom here. So they may only get this first part right here, right? But if they do break it, then we're going all the way down to here. So this is the area at uh, about 91.50. You need to watch for the bounce. Now, several things could happen. You could come down here, get a bounce, and do the 50% uh, fib, and turn around and go right straight back down again. So you can see it's a big opportunity there that could really make you a lot of pips, right? So uh, what what is the trade setup? The trade setup is a break, hook, and go of that fib right there. There are two positions here. And then when if you get a break hook and go of this one right here, there's one, two, and maybe three right in there because this is about 28 pips right there. So you could certainly add a position there, especially if you're in profit up here. Remember that uh, always the first trade, number one, all right, first trade stays on all the way to the end. And the purpose of trade one is to create profit. And that profit covers the risk of every additional trade you put on to the downside. So there you go. Will it happen? I don't know. This is, uh, I'm, you know, it's the 12th of February in the afternoon. So this most likely will not happen till Sydney at the minimum and most likely not until the London market tonight at uh, three o'clock New York time in the morning for, for us. So uh, just keep an eye on it and uh, hopefully it'll make you some pips to, down the way. I'm going to go ahead and put these arrows down here so we're ready for that uh, additional um, move to the downside if we get it. So there you go. All right. Okay, there, there he is, trade of the week. Uh, hopefully it happens and uh, watch it and you'll be in great shape if it does. Have a great day, everybody.